Roles and responsibilities of a civil site engineer Civil engineering. Here is question for civil engineers, show your site knowledge and comment your answer. The site engineer should possess basic knowledge of the practical construction procedures on the site, alongside the small print of how they're planned. This concept of planning and coordination will help him to possess proper execution of the activities on the site with desired performance. The responsibilities that are placed on a site engineer in construction is mentioned briefly below section. 1. Construction Site Responsibilities. The site engineer is that the one that spends most of his time at the construction site compared with other managers or designers. Site engineers are updated daily about the approaching day's design and activities supported which he implements at the site. The top members of the construction organization get a transparent picture of the daily activities happening at the site through the site engineer. 2. Traveling. The site engineers are alleged to move from one site to a different based on the dimensions of the project or number of projects for any special needs. He must even be required to succeed in the procurement of resources to urge the materials as per the right specifications if any discrepancies happen. This means every sector of activities say its design, materials, or execution, the site engineer has the role of recommendation. 3. Technical activities. Site activities like establishment of the extent and therefore the survey control, which is required for the control of contracts must be performed by the site engineer in required conditions. The works need to begin as per the contract drawings. This needs checks on a regular basis on the construction site. The records maintained need to be accurate and that they need to satisfy the organizational and therefore the legal requirements. The site engineer has got to face any unexpected difficulties raised from the technical side at any point in time. 4. Preparation of reports and schedules. The site engineer is that the one who has got to make sure that the site has adequate resources to finish the tasks. This is often conducted by having procurement schedules for the roles administered and liaise with the procurement department regarding an equivalent. The site engineer is liable for keeping site diaries and therefore the respective sheets for allocation. 5. Site engineer for health and safety. For a highly dangerous worksite, the site engineer will take up the role of safety engineer. He has got to make sure that the work administered by the workers and other related activities are as per the security regulation of the respective state or area. 6. Quality assurance by site engineer. As we know, quality may be a parameter that has got to be kept in practice from the initial stage of designing to the top of the project. The main issues with design and documentation are often corrected during the construction by the site engineer supported advice from the structural engineers. As the site engineer needs to know the technical details from the above levels and make it in practice on the site, he must be efficient enough to coordinate the knowledge that's communicated. He must take up the detail from the upper levels accurately and pass them to the below contractors, supervisors, or labor workers. It not how efficiently you as a site engineer understand the thought, but it's how you convey it to your sub-workers.